I've got a few more minutes left in the show, so I want to go back and I want to touch on uh, what has been the most popular item in the broadcast. This is our motion-activated hands-free soap dispenser. And we use liquid soap in several different places of our home. It could be in the bath for hand washing. For most of us, though, we're using some kind of liquid detergent in the kitchen. And that's when your hands are always busy. If you're going to be doing dishes, you probably have a sponge in one hand and a pot or a pan or silverware in the other. So what this is designed to do is to allow you to access your soap without having to push a plunger. The one thing in your house you know is dirty all the time and something you always touch with dirty hands is the plunger on the top of your soap dispenser. But not this one. This is pretty cool. Watch. Are you ready? It senses when your hand is there and automatically dispenses the soap. Now, I don't have a sink here. This is funny that I'm doing these two products back to back. <laughs> that man loves soap. Yeah, I do. <laughs> so now you've got something that makes it a little easier for you to get your job done. And it's automated. It does require four AA batteries. But Donna, who is our guest for this product, uh, had mentioned to me, this is pretty impressive. If you use this 10 times a day, it's gonna, those batteries are going to last you about eight years. It's 30,000 soap dispensers before you have to change the batteries out. There's the black. There's the gray. Uh, no, that's the stainless. I'm sorry. And then we also have the white. In the white, uh, I started with about 345 pieces, and we're down now to how many, Brian? It's less than 300, isn't it? The black, I had about 400 pieces, and there's the stainless steel. It's not a true stainless steel. It's like a metallic silver, to be fair. But because you're using like liquid dish soap, which is a concentrate, you're only using about a half ounce, and then the rest is filled with water. So it's a, a very economic way of getting the most out of your soap. I think this is a neat little automated touch. Here in our studio, our entire building, all, almost all the doors are now automated or, doors. Uh, there's a little sensor that we have on the wall and you wave your hand in front of it and the doors automatically open, okay? Just wave it. And the reason for that is we want less surfaces that multiple people are touching. With this, again, all you do is, you can't sneak up on it. I've been trying. You just walk up, put your hand underneath it, and it dispenses the soap automatically. How cool is that? Uh, I thought that was really brilliant. Now, the next step in technology, and I said this earlier, is gonna be having the automated hand dryers in fast food restaurant bathrooms to actually work. I'd be a happier guy if that happened. Our price on this is $36. I like that we've got four easy pay payments. That's just payments of nine bucks a month. This thing is shipped right away and you'll have it. This was brand new to us on December 4th. So we haven't even had it in the inventory for a month yet. And already now we're limited to less than 2,000 pieces in the inventory. Pick out your favorite color and go from there. Uh, coming up next hour, we've got At Home with Dan. I've got products for your home that hopefully will make your life a little simpler and a little easier. Did you see that little application on the videotape? That's me every night. Uh, I know this is gonna sound really weird. I don't mind doing dishes. A lot of people hate it. I, I find it to be a little relaxing. So I do, I do pretty much all the dishes in the house. Kelly's not a big fan, <laughs> doesn't like doing dishes. Uh, I find a, a, a germaphobe is happy when they get to work with soap. I, I find it to be an enjoyable end of the evening. We've got a dishwasher in the house, but it's just her and I. Why bother? By, by the time I've filled up a dishwasher when there's only two of you, it, it's got a week worth of dishes in it. And then it takes me 15 minutes to empty the thing when it's done. Now I can do dishes. We've got a drying rack. 
They're dry in 15 minutes. I put them away, we're ready to go again. Simple and easy. $36 is your price tag on this, okay? There's only so, so much soap I could put on my hands in one day. <laughs> but that's the way the dispenser works. And, and we've still got all three colors, the black, the white, or the stainless steel. And I won't talk you into using any one particular soap. Use whatever brand of, of concentrate that you use. Now, if you use liquid bath soap that's not concentrate, it'll still work with this. And you have different levels of how much, uh, much soap it will dispense. Because if you're doing dishes in the kitchen, you probably need more soap for that sponge than you do to just wash your hands if you're gonna use it in a bathroom setting. So you get to adjust that. There's also a little button up here on the top, and that's how you turn it on and off. I, I, I can't tell, but you might be able to. It'll blink blue every once in a while. This doesn't require, and I'm not trying to be funny here, you don't have to download an app to your phone do you realize how many ridiculous things in our house we now have downloadable apps for? My wife bought a toaster that I can make toast from my phone. How dumb is that? <laughs> I gave her so much grief about that too. This thing wasn't inexpensive. I just wanted a toaster, you push the lever, it heats bread, that's all I wanted. She got this super toaster from Amazon. Uh, you don't download an app, I don't have to have an internet signal. All you have to do is put your hand in front of it and it will dispense the soap. And when, when it's done, you're, ready, you're set and ready to go again. And it does make really good suds. So what we did is we only put a half ounce of soap in the bottom, which is a minimal amount. The rest is just water. And then you just shake it up once and you're good to go. And it's designed as a foaming dispenser. So even if it's not, quote, foaming dishwasher soap or foaming hand soap, you're still gonna have a foaminess to it. It's a pretty smart little design. That's my favorite part of the video. Watch this. She touches that chicken with her bare hands and then if it were any other soap dispenser, she'd be pushing on the top plunger and leaving that bacteria on the top of the dispenser, which means the next person that comes by and hits it now has that on their hands as well. Now that's all in good if you happen to be using an antibacterial soap, but not everybody does. That's how you cross contaminate. I saw a video, and this was 10 years ago. Uh, it actually, I was a little germaphobic at that point in my life, but this is the video that pushed me over the abyss and told me told me that my affliction was perfectly normal. They, they took raw chicken and they coated it in a powder that when ultraviolet light touched it, it glowed. So you could see everywhere that this lady in the kitchen was preparing chicken, everywhere that she touched. And, and even she had said, I don't remember touching that, but it was the germs from the chicken on the handle of the refrigerator and on the spigot on the sink and on the door of the microwave, on a frying pan that she had moved from the stove, from three of the drawer handles in the kitchen. And then they took her to other areas of her house and showed her that, you know, you forgot to wash your hands before you walked in and touched the doorknob to your, your son's bedroom and, the, and it was, it freaked me out. So now, by the way, feel how smooth. Oh yeah, haven't worked a day in my life, buddy. <laughs> I, pro I probably wash my hands 10 times a day at least. And I moisturize probably 15. But I, I feel healthier and better for being germaphobic. And with the pandemic, I'm not as crazy as I used to be. I, I think I'm ahead of the game. I think this is a brilliant contraption. I think it's wonderful. And at $36, you put it on easy pay, it's four months at nine bucks a piece and you've got it. I happen to have the stainless steel out here. Uh, personal opinion, I like the black just because that matches the fixtures that we've got in our country kitchen. But then we also have the white as well. Pick it up, pick it up, grab it, use it. 
Over 400 have been ordered. You will need four AA batteries, but again, it, it dispenses 30,000 soap dispensions. So that's gonna be 10 a day. That's eight years before you replace the batteries. That's perfect. We're gonna take a real quick break. Probably wash my hands, uh, but I'll be right back. We've got more. Stay with us.